Hi everyone, Aaron Burnett here, and I'm going to sing some songs with you today about Canadian animals. My favorite topic. I love to write songs about Canadian animals. The first song that I'm going to sing for you is about uh, an animal called the buffalo. Real name is bison. But the First Nations people that lived here first, many, many years ago, used to hunt the buffalo for food, clothing, and the night before the hunt, they would start drumming to get ready for the hunt. So I'm gonna ask you to see if you can drum. Use those big muscles in your, your legs and drum along to this beat. So let's give it a try. Feel the beat? Get drumming. Okay, so we're doing our animal songs. Now, I hope everybody out there has had a pet at some time or wanted a pet. I know I've got a little pet that I got before Christmas, a little pet puppy, and maybe I'll get a chance to show him uh, to you at some point. His name is Kai, and he's this tiny little puppy. Anyway, I always wanted a pet when I was a kid, and I was lucky enough to, to get one. So this song I'm gonna sing for you now is about an animal that I thought would be really fun to have as a pet, but maybe I'm not so sure. So I'll play this song for you and you decide whether you'd want it for a pet or not. It's called, well, no, I'm not gonna tell you what it's called. I'm just gonna play it like this. Well, have you ever wanted to have your very own pet? You probably want a dog or cat or a funny rabbit, I'll bet. One that's soft and furry can sleep beside your bed And wake you in the morning when you're a sleepyhead Well, I want one that's different and it would be just mine Cause what I want for my pet is a big old porcupine He'd be kind of roly-poly with long and prickly quills Protecting me from bullies would be just one of his skills He'd be handy had a barbecue a hit with all the fellows He'd sit by the fire and use his quills Marshmallows. When Dad comes home from work and wants me to scratch his back, I'd give him my porcupine and then I'd yell, Attack! Porcupine, you are so fine. Well, porcupine, you're the prickly pet of mine. When Grandma visits our house, she gets mittens by the pair. But if she has a needle, she will always have a spare. 
And when I get a sliver buried just beneath the skin And no one else can get it out, then I'll just turn to him It's great to take to school when we have show and tell He's not as pretty as a skunk, but he sure has a nicer smell Porcupine, you're so fine like a porcupine too. There's a few things around the house you may not want to do. Like having balloons at birthdays, they scare him when they pop. And heading to the bathroom in the dark will have to stop. Cause if you step upon his tail, you'll get an awful fright. Living with the porcupine is better when there's light. Porcupine, you're so fine. Come on over here right now, because I can hear my dad coming home, and I know he's going to want to have his back scratched. Woohoo! Hi again, everyone. I told you about my little puppy, and here he is. This is Kai, and he's five months old, and you know what? He loves it when I read to him. And I've got a book here called Kai. I don't think you can get it in the library, but he loves it. He'll lie on my knee like he is now for hours as I read him stories. And you'll see him, he just lies here and kind of dozes, but he loves listening to the stories. So if you have a pet at home, make sure, get your favorite book and read to your pet. They'll love it. Right, Kai? Okay, the song I'm going to do now is about an animal in Canada that gets a bad reputation. It's the Big Bad Wolf. And I need you to help me on this song. Because in the chorus, I'm going to go, Ooh, I'm going to howl like a wolf, and I need you to howl back. You'll hear my little pet wolf howling in the background, too. Just join in. Okay, here goes. I did not eat those little pigs like all the stories say. Never met Red Riding Hood on that fateful day. I made the villain across this land and I think it's kind of foul. I'm a wolf, hear my howl. life is for me, but when darkness falls I'm hunting, and I'm always on the prowl. I'm a wolf, hear my howl. Ooh, hear my howl. Ooh, 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 ooh. Ooh, ooh, It's not about an animal, 
a Canadian animal, but it does tell us how to take care of our planet and all the animals that live on it. This song is called Think Green. And for this song, I'm going to show you some American Sign Language. It's a, a language that people use that, that can't hear. And for the word green, that's what I'm going to teach you, the word green, every time you hear that word in the song, and it's in there a lot, put this finger straight out and the thumb below it, it's just like the equal sign. And shake your hand twice every time you hear green. Green. You got it. Let's have some fun with this. Here goes. Green is the color of Kermit the Frog. Little Irish leprechauns hiding beneath the log. There's green snakes and turtles and Timothy Green. And a green traffic light that I'm sure you've seen. Green is for nature, the grass and the trees. Think green to save our planet, won't you help us please? Think green when you go to the park to play. Think green before you throw your garbage away. Think green. Oh, I love green. There's dried green tomatoes from Dr. Seuss. Little green marshes that are on the loose. Anna Green Gables is my favorite book. And Shrek the Ogre has a nice green look. Green is for nature, the grass and the trees. Think green to save our planet, would you help us please? Think green when you go to the park to play. Think green before you throw your garbage away. Think green, like St. Patrick's Day. We must eat green veggies cause they're healthy, they say. Our juicy green apple keeps the doctor away. My grandma has a green thumb, my mom tells me. The flower she grows make it green with envy. Green is for nature, the grass and the trees. Think green to save the planet, won't you help us please? Think green when you go to the park to play. Think green before you throw your garbage away. Think green! Well, you gotta love green! Okay, the next song I'm going to do for you is a song about a famous Canadian bird called the mosquito. Well, I guess it's not a, a bird. It's an insect, isn't it? And here I've got with me my wife Kim, and she's going to do some American Sign Language um, to this song. So we're going to explain just quickly, uh, how do you do mosquito, Kim? Isn't that neat? Mosquito drilling into our skin to get our blood. Okay, so here's how the chorus goes. Holy Toledo, it's Maggie Mosquito. She wants to take a bite out of me. I'm gonna give her a smack if she tries to attack because nobody eats for free. Holy Toledo, it's Maggie Mosquito. She's making my skin start to twitch. If she has her way, I'll be scratching all day. I'm already starting to itch. Okay, you've got it, so let's go. Holy Toledo, it's Maggie Mosquito, and she wants to take a bite out of me. I'm gonna give her a smack if she tries to attack, because nobody eats for free. Holy Toledo, it's Maggie Mosquito, she's making my skin start to twitch. If she has her way, I'll be scratching all day. I'm already starting to itch, oh yeah. She's a pesky little insect found all across the globe. She uses heat to find you and your skin she starts to grow. She searches for an opening, but she is after food. Then she begins to feed on you, which just seems kind of rude. Ready? Holy Toledo, it's Maggie Mosquito, and she wants to take a bite out of me. I'm gonna give her a smack if she tries to attack. Bye. 
it's that because nobody eats for free. Holy Tomito, it's a baggy mosquito. She's making my skin start to twitch. If she has her way, I'll be scratching all day. I'm already starting to get scalped. She's lying around my head right now. I cannot let her bite. She'll leave my skin all red and lumpy and such a horrid sight. Holy Toledo, it's Maggie Mosquito and she wants to take a bite out of me. I'm gonna give her a smack if she tries to attack because nobody eats her free. Holy Toledo, it's Maggie Mosquito she's making my skin start to twitch. If she has her way I'll be scratching all day. I'm already starting to itch. Out. If she has her way, I'll be scratching all day. I'm already starting to.